Hi guys and welcome back to Arcadia and uh, you're probably thinking like Scott where are we? Like I've not seen this room before what's happening? And that is because you haven't seen this room before because this is my witchery room. This is where I'm going to be doing all my witchery things. See witchery stuff. So what I've actually done is I've changed a few things. I've put a lower level to the mage tower which is down there. And I've added some floors to the mage tower, which you can fill with stuff. And then that's the top floor. And I also added the three parts for where the nexuses will go. That's like neutral, dark and light nexus. And I changed my house to the silver wood and I love it. Look at how stylish it looks. And we gave Frederick a crown. That was Nicola's idea. So, what we're actually going to do today is we're going to see about doing some of the witchery mod. Now, I say going to see about doing some. I'm the only one on the server and... I don't have anyone I can do any witchery stuff to, but I thought I would show you some of it so that I didn't just come in next episode with all the pure voodoo dolls and everything. So what we're actually going to make, and I've got the stuff for it, is Mutandus. And Mutandus is kind of like bone meal except it changes like grass into a specific type of like plant that you only get through... Um, using mutandus. So we need to do that and put the bone meal there. Uh, oh, what am I missing? Cactus screen. Okay. 13, 12, 14, 12. Okay, that is more than enough mutandus. I don't even think I'll need that much. I also have my blood. Yep, my blood. I will put it in here with the rest of my blood. <laughs> um, if you're wondering how I got my blood, you can take it from beds. You don't need to actually take it from someone, you can just take it from a bed. So, I'll show you here mutandus. If I click that, change it to a birch sapling. Mushroom. Glintweed. Okay, now I need shears for some things. Oh, I can make some. Certain things, and I'm pretty sure this is one of them, only come with shears. Like that was. Um, Ember moss is another one. And Rowan Saplon, I can just break. Do I have space for a Rowan Saplon? I don't. Um, now I do. So, there's one I'm specifically looking. Oh, should have got that. I'm taking any that I don't really know. <laughs> But there's one I'm specifically looking for. It's up. There we go. Okay. So we've got some of that Spanish mouse. And I think I will just plant it on this tree at the moment to let it grow. But I can keep just... See, there's some more. And I think what I will do is I'm just going to keep spamming some stuff. And then I will get back to you once I've actually got some more Spanish moss and can do stuff. So the first thing we kind of need is a poppet. And a poppet requires Spanish moss, wool, string, and bone needle. Now poppets are like your basic voodoo doll. But you can use it, it's not just like doing bad effects. Voodoo dolls are used for good things too. Is it this earth protection pop? If I used it and bound it to myself, instead of taking fall damage, it will take damage of the pop instead of me. Same as that will take drown damage instead of me, that will take hunger damage instead of me, fire damage. Voodoo protection one stops people doing voodoo on me. Pop it protection pop it. I'm not sure what that one does. <laughs> voodoo. Dogs, please! Voodoo Poppet is what I'd use on other people. 
And a bone needle. Oh, we have a poppet. Okay, so poppet, that's just a plain pop, doesn't do anything. We also need to make one of these, which is a poppet shelf, which means I can just put the poppets on there, I don't need to carry them round. And if I had a earth protection poppet and fell, it would damage it here, not where I am. So I need... Okay, so I need a tombstone whiff of magic, so I need to read my book and figure out how to get that. It's not that hard. And then if we do that, that means if anyone else in the server gets voodoo stuff before me, I am protected from their magic and that stops them being able to hurt me. So I think I will go and... Oh, that's... Oh, I did not know you could do that. Wow. Um, do I have any... No, I don't. Okay, back to the chest room. Okay, so we are here and we did not get the 75 like mark today, so we are just going to put one name and that one name is Tiffy Lover. So no two names today, just the one. But the subscriber world's coming on pretty well. We'll eventually fill it all out and maybe have to extend it down that way even more. But voodoo protection pop it and if I click that wee button which I'm now realising it puts it like transparent so I can just go click, click, click and one of you and one of you, one of you one of you and, okay. and finally a mandrake root and I now have a voodoo protection poppet and then to finish it all off I need to take one of my blood and put it there with that and ba bam I have a voodoo protection poppet so if anyone tries to use voodoo on me it will not end well for them so guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, remember to leave a like and a comment and subscribe. We will set a 50 mark like this time because he's only got like 30 something. Maybe he didn't like the episode, maybe that's why. Um, but yes, we are going to see about doing a group recording of Mana Bean Roulette soon. We just need to choose a time and a date for everyone available. And we will get on with that, so I'll keep up to date with everything. Um, and yeah, uh, the question of the video is on screen now. My voice went to like 17 different pitches. And I will see you next time. Bye!